guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video was supposed to be like all happy things and now it's like it's still happy. I mean it's March new releases. Finally here. You guys have been waiting for it, asking for it, and so I'm finally here to show you them and I'm super excited to show you them. Um, I picked out some really um, pretty patterns that I really like. The bad news is going to be about the foiled stickers. So, I'm going to start with the good news first. <laughs> so, I'm going to start showing you all of the March kits first. Okay, so first I'll show you all of our March kits. So this is what the um, budgeting stickers are going to look like. I'm not going to show you all of them. I usually show you all of them, but honestly they're all going to look like this, but just be in their own, you know. So this is the budget kit for March. So you've got like this really dark green here, and then more of like a lighter, not really mint green, but just like a really light green here. But I do really like the way that it came out. This is how I usually uh, envision, you know, March green. Um, so we will have the budget kits, which is, um, you can buy a complete kit, which is gonna be the budget, the weekly check-in, the sinking funds, the transaction long, a thin washi, she and three washi sheets and that's usually around like eighteen dollars um and then you can also buy things separately so we have the march budget weekly check-in sinking funds uh transaction log uh bill tracker debt tracker savings tracker spending tracker um stuff like that um i might be forgetting one but yeah, so the washi that we have for the main kit, which this is going to be kit 33, here is washi number one, and then washi number two, I love this pattern, and then washi number three, which is more like St. Patty's Day theme, and then of course the thin washi to go with the thick washies. And then kit 33 monthly is going to look like this, more of a St. Patrick's Day theme. I do really like this one. <laughs> the um, dashboard for kit 33 is going to look like this. And the second sheet, this will be in one listing, but you get both sheets for that one price. I just couldn't fit it on one sheet. Yep, sorry for my cat, as always. <clears throat> and then we're going to have a monthly sampler. So you get your sidebar, you get some checkbox labels here, event or uh, appointment labels, some decorative boxes, some bigger boxes, the um, holidays, some script stickers and the paydays right there. Then we have a full sheet of washi. So this big washi here should be able to fit in the seven by nine um, boxes, the monthly boxes. So all of the dates that are like the 29th, like the 28th, 29th, 30th, 31st, stuff like that, but that was in the previous month and it's showing in your current monthly view, then if you didn't want that, you can always put this washi strip there and then just trim it down. And then of course you've got like a thin washi and then some skinny washi here. Now obviously you can do a bunch with planning and everything else. Then we have our planner sampler page. I, part of me wants to like either redo this or, uh, add to it like I really like it but even for me like I'm running out of things running out of like labels so I don't know what I'm gonna do yet but as of right now this is the planner 
sampler page so this is like universal for all of like the planning kits you can use it in the monthly view you can use it in hourlies verticals horizontals um, you can use it in plum paper and happy planner and budget mom and whatever you want to whatever planner you want to use it into these are pretty um like normal size and yeah so you get a bunch of labels and functional stickers and stuff like that. Then I also have a full sheet of full boxes. So you get full box, full box, full box, and then half box, and then quarter, quarter. So you've got some deco ones, you've just got some pattern ones, you've got some plain ones. This over here is a usable washi. So in case if I can like pick it up, maybe show you guys. It's like right on the corner but it's a usable washi so you can use that for also planning but if you wanted you could punch holes in it to put it in a binder or if you just put it in a sleeve then you still have that at least so that's that and then the last thing that I'm going to show you from kit 33 is um, our hourly um, kit which we have hourly, vertical, and horizontal, but they all look very similar. So here's the hourly. So the only thing different with the vertical is it's cut into boxes. It's not all one strip. And the other one is um, horizontal, and those are boxes instead of like rectangles. That's the only difference. But this is what Kit 33 is going to look like for the hourly headers and then you can do an add-on so this is my little hourly add-on page so you get another um basically it's just like a four by six page with some like sample stickers so you get some like mixed script stickers you get some icons you get another weekend banner in case you didn't want to pick up the planner sampler and you just get this one you can definitely plan with just these two and then this gives you a taste of like different stickers. So like I said, you get the mixed scripts, you get the icons, you get another weekend banner, you get an arrow, you get some check boxes, a um, clip art box, and then these little teardrops, and then some like these two appointment labels here. Like that. So that is it for kit 33. So let me move on to kit 34. So kit 34, this is going to be your extra washi one. I love this, it's so pretty. And then here's the monthly view. Your dashboard pages. The monthly sampler. The full sheet of washi, the planner sampler page, the full boxes. Not every kit I buy and choose has um, clip art in it, so there are there may be some like kits that don't have clip art, but they still have very pretty boxes. So. There's that, and then the last but not least is the hourly stuff. So here are the headers, and here is the add-on. So that is that for kit 34. Kit 35 is one of my favorites, which really surprises me kind of. But this is going to be your extra washi too for kit 35. I love these butterflies, which I'm usually not a big butterfly person. But when I saw this, I was like, oh my goodness, this goes with like the other greens that I was kind of aiming for. So I really like this. And then your monthly view. I feel like this one's going to be a big hit. 
more dashboard pages. Or a monthly sampler. I do love all of the colors, but it's still like, you know, March. Like, it still has like a greenish color and like a salmon-y color and a gold color. Then, of course, our washi sheet. Our planner sampler sheet. Our full box sheet. And the hourly headers. And the hourly add-on. And I should mention that the only thing different, like the hourly and the vertical look exactly the same. The only add-on that looks different is the horizontal and that's because I think it's the check boxes are bigger or longer I think. I think I have more check boxes in that so it only made me, so everything basically got scooted over because they probably go around here. So this had to be moved over, this had to be moved over so you only get two teardrops and one appointment label box um, for the horizontal in that. But that's the only change to that and then we have one more kit to release and it's probably like i would say it's probably my favorite so this is going to be your extra washi three so this is kit 36 and i just love this so much i love the contrast and then here's your monthly view Here's your dashboard pages. The um, seven, this is the seven by nine size. The A5 should come all on one sheet and then the eight and a half by 11 comes in something similar like this. It'll come in two sheets. Then we have our monthly sampler. We have our full sheet of washi. Our planner sampler page. I do love this page. It's very functional. I just feel like I run out of labels, but I also do um, have the hourly add-ons too, so that helps. And then here is the uh, full box sheet. And I just love this. I love all of the little clip art that I put in here. It's like little succulents and everything. I love it. And then last but not least, our hourly headers and the hourly add-on. And I just love this so much. So much. So that is all of our good news. <laughs> our bad news that's coming up is the foiled stickers. And I apologize, guys. I thought that I had everything set and ready to go. I mean, this is what they were looking like like you can see like absolutely perfect like this was basically a flawless flawless like no black toner dots or anything just pure foil so I was very happy posted that you know oh we're gonna have foiled stickers like either January 7th or January 10th whenever I got around to making the stock and then being able to make the listings take the photos get it all like published and ready to go and so last night well yesterday sa Saturday I'm filming this on Sunday Saturday I spent all day printing and cutting and organizing and cutting up all of the um, sheets for foiling and getting everything all re ready, like dusted all of the foil off, dusted all of my, like I went through the exact same process that I did with this one, right? Today, I'm like, okay, perfect. All I have to do is run the foil and stuff through my make machine and everything will be great. And then this is how it's turning out. I don't know if you guys can see 
I don't know if you're going to be able to see. Maybe if I turn the light off. There you go. Do you see all of those black foil or black toner dots? That is what I am getting today. It's all over. It looks so bad, you guys. So bad. And I did the exact same. Like this is pretty flawless, right? Don't see any black toner dots. But then I did the exact same thing today and it is coming out so, so bad. And I cannot sell these, like absolutely cannot sell these. And part of me was like, oh, I'll just give away like all of the ones that I mess up on as freebies, right? Fine for the ones that are like, like okay but this one I don't even know if this would even pass as a freebie like this is just so bad like I am so disappointed I'm so sad and I hate to announce that I'm gonna have to push the foiling the foiled stickers release back until I fully grasp until I can get it back to whatever I did here even though I literally did the same thing here that's why I'm so confused because this is so perfect and this is so wrong. <laughs> so, yeah, unfortunately, that is my bad news. And I hate to announce that, but when I do finally figure out a plan, a method, a system, a routine, I will let you guys know and I will make it up to you. I will, um, my plan is, is when I, my plan is, is when I figure it all out, I will have a huge release. Like I will do many scripts. I will make sure that I have everything ready, that it's all good foil and everything's ready to go for you guys. And I will have a foil sale. I don't know what the code is going to be yet or anything like that. I will make sure that I let you guys know what it is, but this, I cannot sell this. If, if they came out like this, they would be coming out today when you watch this. And I am so sad that I can't make that happen. Like I said, I could. I am just as sad as you guys. I, I promise. <laughs> I'm very, uh, discouraged at this point. I don't know where to go from here. I'm kind of back at step one. With the whole foiling process, I feel like I need to just take a day or two break from it, refresh my mind, and um, probably like get a fresh mindset and basically start from scratch and see where I can go from there and see if I can get it back to this because like I said I don't know what happened today I don't know what changed this was you know I did this on Monday I did this on Saturday I knew exactly what I did here I had my notes written down I did the exact same for this and it came out so bad I want to cry I wanted to cry when I saw this because it was so beautiful and perfect and flawless and I was proud. And then I wanted to cry when I saw this because I was so disappointed and discouraged and very sad and really did not want to show you guys this but or give this announcement to you guys because I know you guys have been so excited for these. You've been asking for these. I wanted to deliver and I had a plan to deliver and it's just not working out and I apologize for that. But I will make these up to you guys when I finally get this system down. But other than that, guys, I am going to let you go. Let me just give you a quick sneak peek of, or a quick uh, view of the monthly views again, just real quick, just to rejog your memory. Um, a last minute look in case you wanted to head over to my Etsy shop and purchase any of these new releases. Anything March release related, you can use the um, coupon code 
lucky 30 and that will give you 30 percent off um, anything that is a new release so anything that i showed you guys today you can use the code lucky 30 i cannot find the other one here we go lucky 30 for 30 percent off any of these patterns for march so yeah so i'm sorry for the bad news but i'm not sorry for giving you all of these beautiful stickers <laughs> this month so at least there's that but i'm gonna let you guys go if you like this video if you like the new march uh kits please give this video a big thumbs up it will probably boost my spirits so much talk to me in the comments tell me which kits you like um which one's your favorite and everything i definitely think 36 is my favorite it is so beautiful i mean i love them all but i think 36 is my favorite um but if you want to stick around for our budgeting journey videos and i think i'm going to start doing like a savings challenge this this year as well so i'll probably include that maybe in like our weekly check-ins or something and then um, I also do plan with me and sometimes I do behind the scenes of an Etsy shop owner. Um, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would love to build this community of sticker lovers and planning and budgeting and all of that fun stuff. Um, but other than that, I will let you guys go and I will see you on Thursday for a plan with me.